a lot of Twitter followers. Someone even commented asking for a live stream on how to use the deaf shade of lipstick. Let me see. How to use the death shade? That's not a bad idea. Hello everyone! A few days ago I saw a number of you on Twitter complaining that your boyfriends had bought you Nightmare Barbie Pink lipstick. Actually, Barbie Pink can look good too. Today, I'm going to teach you how to make good use of the Notorious Devil Shade. Those of you with darker or lighter complexions can use Barbie Pink lightly. For other skin colors, apply a white powder foundation first. In terms of the eyes, you want to emphasize girlishness. Lengthen your eyelashes like this to make your eyes look bigger and more charming. I don't recommend using pink eyeshadow because it will look too pale and unnatural. I suggest you use grapefruit orange and champagne gold as a foundation. For my eyebrows, I usually go with light brown. If you want to look a little more trendy for the sake of taking photos, you can give watermelon red a try for highlights. You can really increase your classiness with just highlighter. Blend with two shades of the pink brush to increase the girliness. Isn't it eye-catching and bold? It's great for dates and stuff like that. Boys will be all over you. Check your Twitter. You're one of the hottest searches. Lots of beauty live streamers have started copying you and challenging themselves with Barbie Pink. I can't believe someone managed to shake things up with purple and black lipstick challenges. Have I inadvertently set off some bizarre wave in fashion? What's the news? Your phone is constantly pinging. Let me see. Oh my god! So many brands are inviting you to cooperate with them! You're gonna make big money! Though, why are so many brands sending me olive branches? That Barbie pink lipstick you live-streamed about before has sold out online! Who wouldn't want such an effective means of advertising? It sold out? Am I a marketing genius without even knowing it? Of course! You're the best! How about we go out for a fancy meal to celebrate your big break? Hello! I'm the sales director of A Family Cosmetics. Do you know about our products? A Family? Isn't that a domestic cosmetic brand that's become super popular recently? Yes, I've heard of your products, but I haven't tried them yet. If you don't mind, we would like to send you some products for you to try out. Listen, my main reason for calling you is to discuss potential cooperation. However, we would like you to do a joint live stream together with our spokesperson. I'm not sure who your spokesperson is. Actually, you and our spokesperson seem rather faded. You were in the same issue of Heartland Magazine. Don't tell me your spokesperson is you, Fei Fei. Yes. And actually, this is our first time doing a collaboration between two live streamers. It was she who recommended you. So it wasn't through my livestream that you found me. 
while it was Feifei who recommended you, it was after watching your live stream that we decided to cooperate with you. Thank you. I think I need to think this over. I totally understand. I will have one of our staff mail you some of our products. You can try them out, then give us your answer. A Family is certainly a reputable brand. But you, Feifei, and I didn't exactly get along swimmingly at Heartland. Why would she recommend me? What's that you, Feifei, up to this time? Do you think maybe we're overthinking it? Perhaps she just saw my marketing abilities and so... Are you stupid? That you, Feifei, is a bad apple. I mean, what if she does something nasty against you while you're live streaming together? Then I'll decline. Wait a second. How much did the brand offer as compensation for cooperating? They want to work with me long term. The price was six figures. Whoa. In all my life, I've never seen such money. What's to fear about some nasty girl? I could handle her, no problem. You little money grubber. I think you should focus on your own live stream. Has it already started? Is Feifei going to say hi to your fans? Hello, my dearests. Did I keep you waiting? I've been very busy with announcements recently and my schedule is packed, so I'm very sorry. Probably using A Family's S17 Nude and Y47 Tomato. Those are really popular recently. <laughs> of course, I'm using A Family's lipstick. You've got quite the eye. When I went to audition, the director even said, No good, you're too young. <laughs> I'm not young. Anyway, it's not like I rely just on my appearance. Guys, now let us introduce the A families. Hush, everyone. Feifei is the spokesperson for A family. She's here to introduce you to the A family cosmetics together with me. Most of A family's cosmetics are worth trying, but the highlighters are a little basic, so you can treat them as just touch up products. If you want some more exuberantly colored highlighters, you can give Bot a try. I'll show you them in detail in the next private live stream. Miss, should you really be recommending other brands? I'm the spokesperson for A Family, and I'm sitting right here. This is my live stream. If I don't present my own subjective opinion, whose will I present? All my fans know that I only recommend products that I think are good. I don't just advertise them without thinking. My fans come before the brands. Girl, you just graduated from college, right? You should learn a thing or two about how to deal with people. You won't get far in the entertainment industry like this. 
<laughs> I know how to deal with people in my own way. You don't need to educate me. <laughs> What's the use in being arrogant? In a world where popularity speaks, who's gonna listen to your teachings? <laughs> <laughs>